That's not right. I'm not crying. Uh, hello, everybody. My name is... Well, my current name is now Andy... I'm sorry. Andy 64 Zilla. As you can see, I'm fitted rightfully in my uh, my mecha costume, as you can see here. I have the maid dress, a little... I changed my hair color, obviously, to suit their hair. It is now uh, like a vibrant, I guess, violet color-esque. And I put on some... Uh, put on some neat slippers. White and such. I got... I got some gloves. I found some gloves and they neatly match my little the thingy for the maid. Very fitting, I think. Oh, and I have the, I have this wings and tail that just suddenly grew out, but it's fine. They, they work too. I can, I'm literally flying right now. So today we're going to be doing some. We're going to be doing some. Uh, very spectacular, spooky streamings. That of which I will not detail until we get until we get into it, you know? Oh, hello, Mecca. You're here. I'm uh, sorry. Spirit O'Link. Sp no. S Mecca O'Link. That's your name. That's your name right now. Yes, you look great because I am you, and that's why you look great. Because it, I'm you. Because it's literally me. See, look, I, I have flappable wings. And of course, I had, the, I had some emotes drawn with this. This is me all starstruck, happy. This is me mad. See, look, you see the emotion on the little mecha thing on the top of my face. This is me sad. I'm very sorry. See, even look, the mecha thing is crying too. Look at his teardrop. Me scared. Look at his eyes up there. Little, uh, um, you, you know, the, the type of, uh, flushed emotions. Then there's like, hmm, isn't that interesting? I'm also, we have double eyebrows. And this is me when I'm sleepy, I guess. I put more effort to be, well, yeah, man, you gotta draw your... You should. You just totally draw your own thing. Well, not draw your own thing. I don't mean. I don't mean like that. But like you know, you could. There's tons of you can do with PNG tubing. I have. I have all this going on, but I also have. I have old man Andy right here. As you can see, it is me in like sixty or eighty years from now. Hello, I have time traveled to the year of now. To bring you a warning. Whatever you do, do not eat chocolate. It is bad for your health. As sugary as it is good, it also has very dangerous calories. You must have eaten it on as I too much work. I doubt that it's very much. You need to understand that too much work for an artist, there is never too much work except the work that they do themselves. And even then, it takes a while because sometimes we don't want to do the work, but it has to be done. Just like, just like in uh, the war. The war, there's, you have to do some hard things in drawings. You have to do the same for the war. Uh. So yeah, how is everybody today? Good. I'm so good. I feel like I'm gonna, I'm gonna age as old as this after I finish watching these videos, because I feel like you know, it's gonna be, it's gonna be a very, very scary time. I'm gonna get so scared. I'm gonna grow old and wrinkle just like this. It's not gonna be good. It's not gonna be fun for everybody. I know. Honestly, just talking this much very slowly, just so I don't have to start the thing. It's because, you know, I really don't want to finish it. I don't want to start it. I feel like I will get paranoid. I'll get scared. And then, I don't know, I'll have a heart attack, maybe. Because 
It is an old bed. You cannot watch scary things without having risks such as, you know. So it'll be, it'll be a bad time. It'll be a real bad time. So yeah, how are you, Mecca? Are you fine? I started watching Ultraman earlier. I remember what I used to watch. Ultraman. The very first Ultraman. It came out on Saturday mornings. It was very, very fun. Very good. I loved it when this guy said, I am Ultraman, and he started Ultramaning all over the place. That was peak cinema. And now I should know. I was there when cinema was invented. It was just great, man. Okay, you're dead. Let's, let's, I think we should, I've already, I've already talked long enough. It's already been, uh, well, I mean, it's been 20 minutes, nearly 20 minutes. It's been 20 minutes for, uh, you know, 20 minutes on the waiting time. I grew older in that time. But then, I don't know, I guess, was it, was it 10 minutes ago? Have I been talking for 10 minutes? I don't know. Then I don't know what to do. You're tired from the Ultra the Man, same. I am tired from being an old man. You know how it is, you're getting tired during the day. And you're like, I can relate to this. That's literally me right now. Here I am old. Look at my long beard. I'm like Master Shifu. I even said say whoa. So, uh, yeah. Good to hear, uh, Mecha Olink. This is Dao. I will cut back to Andeo Link, er, Mech and a 64 Zella soon. When we get to, when we get to the reaction. Uh, man in the suit, I don't look horror. 1954. I was alive during that time. 1954, I remember. That was my, that was my 50th birthday. I had my 50th birthday that year. It was a, it was a magical time. I remember the candles, the cake, the Christmas presents. Wait, no, it wasn't Christmas. It was my birthday. What am I talking about? I don't know. Okay, well, I'm gonna go. I'll leave the reaction to that. This and I'm gonna, I'm choking on my beard. I'm gonna leave the reaction. To my friend, my past self, and a 64 Zilla, it's now your turn. Go. Go. Oh, I'm too small. Now I'm back. Hi. Hi, hello, hello. It's me now. It's me now. Okay. Um. So yeah, I am. I really don't want to get sorry because. Okay. <laughs> Listen. Okay. Look. I am not. I am not. Okay. I'm not good with scary things, especially you know. The new crave that is analog horror, uh, has not been has not been kind to me because you know I. I really oh, hold on getting that old that old man voice really got me <laughs> uh, okay 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 all right uh yeah so this is uh the Godzilla suit incident analog horror by uh unknowingly no it's not by unknowingly whatever their name is it's their name is literally unknowingly so uh yeah <laughs> yeah, I know that. I know that, Mecca. If it wasn't for earlier, well, I was like practically still asleep. Oh, that's the wrong email. Uh, switch back, get me out of here. You got it. Uh, this is uh, uh, very sleepy. Like, literally. Like, I was like, uh, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, yeah. Um, I was gonna do it earlier, but you know. I don't want to get scared, like, early in the morning, so now I have to get scared in the afternoon, so. 
It's, it's, just, it's literally me picking my, my poison here. And my poison is picked. It's ticking me off. So, uh, yeah, I know nothing about this. I just know, uh, it's a Godzilla suits, and there's a man in the suits. The man is in the suits, and I, I felt, you know, this is kind of necessary to, this is really, this, this is a good thing to, this what should be, it should be the first thing I watch as I am. Mecca. Oh, <laughs> this is Becca. Hey, Halloween. I dressed up as him. I have his maid dress, his little his little thingy on the his little hat, I guess. And also, I have a tail and wings. So, you know, uh, might as well get into it. You know, this is gonna be the first of many things I have planned. I hope I can get them all done. And uh, I stood you up and told you everyone there to fit How can what are you talking about? This is nothing. This is not me. This isn't. This is. Don't look. Don't look at me. What are you talking about? I don't know what you're talking about. What are you talking about, Ghosty? You 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 you, see, you saw nothing. You're seeing nothing right now. Look at the. No, I'm not a fin boy. I'm literally. Just, I'm literally fin, fin. I'm you. I'm dressing up as you, Mecca. I'm you, Mecca. I'm dressed up as you. How could you say that? I get it. I lie to you, Ghosty. I swear. This is this is not what it looks like. This is not what it looks like. Literally. Ghosty, listen, look. I'm doing this. I'm dressing up as Mecca. I'm not. This isn't what I would wear normally. You have to believe me. I did not lie to you. I swear, Ghosty. I know you stood up for me, but this is not. This is not. This is not anything. You need. You need to hear me out. You need to listen. Listen to me, Ghosty. I'm not a bad boy. I've told everyone this. Everything is lies. I don't want to I don't know lies. I mean it. I go to ghosty, please. I did not mean to lie. If, if I did, I didn't. It's better because I didn't lie. This is this this is not this is not what it looks like. This is literally not anything. This is literally just me as Mecca. We're we're doing a thing where we switch we switch each other's costumes. Our costumes for Halloween. Uh, this is this is not what I would wear usually, I swear. Ghosty, listen. Please. Please, Ghosty. Continue to, continue to. I need to see Mecha. Mecha right now, he's in the chat. Go watch him. He's literally in chat. He's literally in chat. You need to see Mecha. Yeah, he's in chat. He, he wears this. He wears worse stuff than this. You should see him. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, that's him. That's him right there. He knows. He knows. He does this. He put me in this costume. It was all him. Oh yeah, he's spirit right now. But he, but before that, he was he was he was very sus. Worse than me. You must understand, Ghosty. Please, we have to. We 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 could we could do this all like all the time. But we gotta we gotta watch the video. Like we we could can we can we discuss this some other time, Ghosty? Please. This is no this is not the time for, this is not the time for any of that. We have to watch the video. Yes, yes, okay, okay, okay. We're good now. We're good now. We're okay. All right. Let me just um, let me uh fly back up here. I wouldn't. I'm not gonna tell you what I said about you. You're a fanboy. I know. I'm not a fanboy. <laughs> this is literally. This is. This is not me. This is not what I wear. This is not what I would do in my free time. I swear, Ghosty, please. You have to believe me. No. You don't believe me? Ah. I can't. I, I, watch my video. Okay, fine. I'm going to watch this scary Godzilla video. Please S stick around, I guess, to watch me get scared. I don't know. I don't know anything about this. I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know what's going on. You will. Okay, thank you, Ghosty. Thank you. I can at least, I can at least, I can at least count on you for that. All right. Great. And uh, yeah. Uh, once again, just to be clear, this is not. 
Why do you say it like I'm worried this because of Mecca? Fanboy? Fan fanboy. Well, I like the sound of fanboy, but not so much fanboy. That's just uh that's just a different kind of like it, you know, Lucas, my fam, it's a fanboy. That's a that could be that could be a good saying to be honest. Hey, look, it's the fanboy. You know what I'm saying? All right. Um, but yeah, this was a this was a this was this was not my idea. For the record, I wore this because of Mecca wearing this. I like that too. A little. Yeah, that's it. That's true. That's true. I wore this because of Mecca, so it's all his fault. I wore it better, but Andy's definitely slaying it. You know what? Thank you. And yes, I am. I am slaying it. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Wow, I'm actually looking up at chat. I'm literally looking at chat. And so is a little thing on my head. He's little Mecca. That's what, he's literally little Mecca. That's what he is. He's, my hat is actually alive. In case you didn't know. Fanboy for real. Wow. Wow. I can't believe this. You put me in a dress, a big dress, and then you call me names? I believe you, Mecca. Wow. Okay. But yeah, it, it's his fault, just to be clear. This was this was all his idea, his plan. And now, I'm here, wearing this, and getting to, getting to watch scary videos. So that's what we're going to do. That's what we're going to do today. This is the... This is the Godzilla suit incidents in 1944. Godzilla analog horror. Now, I have minimal experience with analog horror. You know what I do here, It's probably fantastic this. The one I saw years ago was like Local 58, I think. That one. And then uh, a few others, to be honest. I've, I haven't really... I don't. I watch them, but I don't, I don't like catch up with them. You know what I'm saying? Like... Like if I, I'd rather watch a video explaining it than watch Local 58 is so good. Yeah, I know. I'd rather watch a video explaining the horror of analog horror than uh than actually watching it. Like you know uh like like w Wendigo. I watch I watch him. I watch him a lot. I watch his videos explaining about it, so I don't have to watch the original and get scared. <laughs> so uh yeah. Also yeah, I guess I do have. It's sort of black eyeliner, but don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Um, yeah, this this is very scary, and we're gonna watch this today, and we're gonna get very scared. So, uh, I think I've talked long enough. It's already been thirty minutes. I fell on all. You have a list. Please share the list. <laughs> Go see. Maybe we'll watch the whole thing someday. We could. We could. We 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 could actually. We could collab that if you want. You know. Oh man. I'd be down to do a group reaction of all analog horrors with friends, of course, because I'd be utterly terrified to watch them all by myself. Literally, like what I'm doing right now. You would love that? Yeah, that'd be awesome. Yeah, just let me know whenever you're available, dog. Dog fam fanboy. Well, I guess I'm the I'm I'm the fanboy. I guess not so much you. I see your messages in the group chat, Mecca. Don't think I don't know. You're the fanboy fanboy. I can't today. I'm going to see Yeah, it's only totally, okay. It's only totally okay, Ghosty. You don't don't worry about it. We I meant like you know some other time whenever whenever you're available or when I want to do it. You know, just let me know. You're the fanboy fanboy. Thank you. Don't worry about it, Spirit. You don't have to watch. Lurk. What does that mean? <laughs> Alright, uh enough uh enough fin boy fill boy stuff. Sorry still at work, I'm here in the back. Oh gotcha. It's it's cool though. Join to find out. All right. Well, you know what? Let's go ahead and start this already. We've, uh, of course, uh, Gazelle Suit Incidents 1954 Gazelle Animal Horror is brought to you by, uh, I don't know, the original Godzilla. So go watch, go watch the original Godzilla. Well, and then watch the Spirit. Spirit's here. Hi, Spirit. I'm here in my Mecha costume. 
No, I'm not the fan boy. I'm literally. Um, this is Mecca. This is Mecca's fan. This is this is Mecca's fan Mecca. I'm dressed as fan Mecca. This is not. This is not anything to do with that. Listen. I know you're a bot, and I tell you things, but this is this is not this is not what that is. You could have dressed up as Milmeca. I don't have a Milmeca reference. Well, I mean, I already drew, I already drew Mecca as from Mecca, so I don't have. I I don't, I don't have a I don't have a male Mecca reference. I have fem Mecca. So what's the difference, you know? Besides, I have his wings. Aren't his wings cool? You have the red Andy. Oh, ref. Well, the it's fine. You don't have, you don't have to give the ref. That's it's totally fine. I have I had, uh. Well, I mean, I already had him, but I already drew him as this. So there is also Kaiju Mecha. I can't be Kaiju Mecha. I I I, I couldn't fit in my house. I couldn't fit in my house as I was Kaiju Mecha. I'm already small, so I'm like two feet tall. So uh yeah, we're here now. I'm in I'm in, I, I I just threw it together and you chose to be Fem Mecha. I did not choose this. I literally drew this for you. I drew Fem Mecha first for you as your character. And because I already had you could have also used a onesie. I don't have onesies. I just I just had the dress that I made. I mean, yeah, the dress that I made for you. So I just decided to put it on. I also found these gloves in the back and I thought they kind of fit, so I just put those on. And then I grew wigs a tail. And I guess I also dyed my hair violet. Which this is, I'm pretty sure this is violet hair. Not a... You chose me from Mecca, would you do a job Mecca as a man? <laughs> okay, okay, look, I, this is the only one I had, and I wanted to get dressed quickly. I was like, okay, what do I wear? Do I wear male Mecca or fem Mecca? I'm like, okay, let me just, uh, let me, uh, I guess I'll put this on. No, it's no big deal, no big deal. And it's no big deal, guys. Don't worry about it. You know that you make a yeah, I know that, but it doesn't matter. It's fine. It's just it's just a made dress. End of the day. End of story. Done. You don't have to. You don't have to. We don't have to. We don't have to make a big deal over this. They get dressed to be Halloween. You saw the art. He is male right now. It's just like me and day. I know that. This isn't about. This isn't about. This is about me and and him. This is about me and him. I didn't have any suits for him or any refs quickly, so I just put on the dress. You did, Andy. You did. Okay. Okay. Well, I do. I do have his wings, so it's not totally. It's not totally bad. Oh, and also, I didn't have a size earlier, but I also have. I also have. I also have. I have a secret. A secret. Uh. What do you mean? I would dress up as a fanboy either way. That's how that works. No. That is not how it works. But yeah, I also have, I also, uh, <clears throat> it's an all fan, but I also, I, I, <laughs> I, 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 I also have, uh, they all made me, I am here to get scared, and, 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 and I feel like if I watch one more of these videos, I'll have a heart attack. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, it's me here, and also old me, he's over there, so. We're gonna set old me down for a nap while I go and watch this video. If you don't want us to call you fun boy, why do you complain when I call you one? Because I don't, I, I don't know. Okay, I, it's, 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 it's the difference between being a fan boy and just wearing things. You know, this is me wearing things. I'm not a fan boy. I've never been a fan boy. Never. I don't know what I'm talking about. Dot dot dot. And 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 what about what? What's up? You are. You are luck. You are luck. You are I am into what? What? You are lucky. I am at work. Oh, why? What? <laughs> what are you gonna do? I would just. I'm. I'm just being. I'm just. I'm just being a little silly. I'm. I'm I'm just wearing this costume for Halloween. It's it's it's, it's literally just a costume. I'm like, I'm, I'm, this isn't what I wear under my free time, Spirit. You must understand. 
I will jump in your stream and call your names. <laughs> well, that would be that would I guess I wouldn't I wouldn't have minded I guess you know at least it would be somebody you're watching this scary with me. It would be it would be preferable to be honest, but don't mess with spirits. They can draw. I mean, yeah, that is true. I am not I'm not messing with you, spirit. I'm just saying I'm just trying to give my logic, my breakdown, my my uh you know my my sense of work my my opinions my sense of self watch it yourself andy no you have to watch it by yourself watch it yourself wow okay 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 fine i'll watch it by myself because no one else is here with me <laughs> okay i'll do that fine 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 Fine, I'll do that. Okay. I cho I know I chose this one for myself. But it's a costume. You know? It's not like it's not like I wore this for any other occasion. <laughs> You're totally gonna draw this later, aren't you? I just know it. You chose a few versions. Yeah, I know. Okay, fine. I did because that's the only. I mean, yeah, to be honest, uh, out of out of the others, well, I I included the wings from his uh, kaiju form, though. You can't you can't you can't discount that. I have his wings and his tail, so there. And his hat too, but I guess that was already part of it. Yeah, that was already part. Of it. If Femzilla was the only friend, I would let this slide. Well, it's so easy. You please let it slide either way. But there are three forms. Okay, well. Well, if you also remember, there was that one time I just wore, like, straight-up maid dress. So, I was already prepared, in a sense, for this. So, you know. Andy 64 Godzilla R win. Okay, yeah, I guess that is the, I guess that is the name of what I'm wearing right now. This is Andy sixty four Zilla. Nice to meet you. There was another reason for the maid dress elder Andy. <laughs> this is this is not this is making this is this is made this is just... I I already had a maid dress. It just I like it was like I don't know, painted red, or like a dark reddish brown. I think you did it because you wanted. Okay, what do you want me to do? Take the take it off. If I take it off, I revert to old man. Looks he watch. Uh, it's off now, and I am, I immediately aged. This, uh, I am older now. I am, it's, uh, it's just, uh, just, uh, just, uh, there. there, okay. Can we be done? <laughs> no, Andy. Okay. Don't take it off. You're currently streaming. I know that. But I, it's not like I'm, I'm wearing my regular clothes to the teeth. I, I showed it already. But I take it off when I turn, I turn into old man me. I'll take it. Okay, okay, okay. I I know I understand, but you know it's there's a difference between. Okay, there's a difference between wearing this like casually and then just wearing it, you know. Uh. You know, wearing it for a costume. And this is just a costume. So. Okay, yeah. Guess I will say. Alright. Fanboy. I can't, I can't see the emails. They're so small. Oh, it's. No, there is not a difference. Alright. If, if you... If you say so, I kind of don't know. I'm I, I don't know how it works. I'm I, I'm all right. I'm a, I'm a beta femboy. I don't know how it works. There is Andy. Okay. Anyways, uh, now that we got it away, I'm a femboy. Okay, femboy. I'm in a maid dress. I'm not one to deny that. So, uh, Fanboy Andy, you dressed as Fanboyzilla. Okay, yes. I dressed as Fanboyzilla because 
I thought it would be funny. <laughs> you know, I already had a reference of myself wearing one, so like, why not wear it as Max? <laughs> I thought it would be. I thought it would be funny. You know. And then you get the last laugh here. Okay. I will. Ha 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 ha. Also, yeah, I guess I have a marine black eyeliner, so just uh add one more to the pile. So uh yeah. I think we've I think uh, can we can we move on please? Like because yes. I agree I am here we laugh at you stream and there's a fanboy allegations going around Okay, yes, I'm sure you read what Ghosty said earlier. Fanboy and Sue went never. I'm that's technically just me right now. I guess I don't know, unless I put on a Godzilla suit and then boom. That's me. I should totally do that actually. I could draw that. Make that sometime. But not today. Uh, we're gonna be busy today because today we are in with the bed in the suit. Me <sighs> Vincent. Okay, yes, I am. What are you gonna? He is the family in the suit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's that's me. That's me. I'm I'm here. That's me. Mhm. Mm right now. Yeah. Uh -huh. Oh, I didn't mean to put us chat. Okay, so are we done or can we move? Can we watch? Can we watch the video or videos? I have like it's a whole playlist, a whole playlist of scary things that's gonna send me to to heck and back from how scary it is. And I, for one, don't want to stick around to see. You need to add fanboy tag your stream now. What are you talking about? I this is only for get scared now. All right, you got it. Wait, dude, can I actually do that though? Hold on. Uh, oh. You say the internet. Okay. Um. You know what? Fine. I'll do it just be just because. Fanboy gaming. <laughs> no, we're not, we're done. We're not gaming right now, but I'll just put that there. There we go. Done. Stream is updated. There. There. Are we good now? We're we good. We're we good. We're we good now. Blood V Heart. All right, all right. Getting scared now. We're gonna get very scared right now when we watch, when we watch, Godzilla Suit Incident, nineteen sixty four. Godzilla and a Hunger. It's not. It's not titled Man in the Suit. It's titled something. Oh, wait, is this is this even the video? Hold on. Okay, yeah, it's the first video, and then, and Guy Russ is the second video. So it's gonna be it's gonna is it gonna go like go through each films, I assume. I don't know why I did that. That was random. Yes, okay. Um please stick around here in case I get confused about what is to do with what. So uh yeah, let's 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 what let's let's get into the video, okay? Enough enough about me and my fanboyism, I guess. Let's watch, let's watch the video. Godzilla, Analog Horror, The Man of the Suit, YouTube Profile 1. Here we are. Now, judging from, you know, most Analog Horror, I get to be very scared by it, because all you have to do is put a filter on and I get immediately get tense. Like, like, <laughs> I don't, I don't want to see that, you know? So, it's going to be, it's going to be a little... It's gonna be a little spooky today, but ah! bro, the animation. Yeah, yeah, I, I wanted to make it so like you know they're kind of flapping and you know just making me stay afloat because the wings they do help you fly, and that's what they're doing here. See, ding, ding. See, and they help me fly, and I move my tail. Cause yeah, this is what happens. This is what happens. When you have a maid suit. It gives you a wings and tail. So, 
You must understand. Yep. So, uh, yeah, let's get into, let's get into the video. And we can talk about all this later. Uh, for now, let's talk about scary stuff. And such as Godzilla Suit Incident, 1964, and Godzilla and Hong Kong, brought to you by Adobe Lee. Oh. Oh. <laughs> you ever talk about this more? Hmm? Fanboy Sue, which is bad news too. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Guess so. Ugh. I'm gonna stretch. I know it doesn't look it, but I have to stretch. I gotta stretch a lot more now, because I have wings. Well, wings are currently, they're flapping a bunch right now, and I guess because they're trying to keep me, keep me, they're trying to keep me afloat in this orange void, so I can get to watching this video. Because you know how hard it is to find a suit like this in the void? Orange void, no less, not even in my regular home. This is the Halloween home. Like, because even Band-Aid freaks out when I show him this. He gets... Never, never mind, never mind. Um, let's get into the video. This is Godzilla Suit Incident 964. I said this like a lot of times. Alright, let's 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 just get into scary, okay? We're watching the scary right now. No interruptions, no nothing, no anything. Let's watch the first video. Godzilla Suit Incident 964 on the horror, then three, two, one. Ooh, I don't like that. You know you know something's gonna happen with you have all these here, and there's both recently played. That's... That's gonna be not good. Alright. Let's get into it. Five, four, three, two, one. Play. Partridge tape. Wow, that's like the old thing too. But like I don't know, done with the filter or something. Looks like grainy image of Godzilla back there. That's. This kind of hits though. gone now the person in Godzilla suit was unknown at the time okay they just didn't know who he was but with the story the actor has with Godzilla Gojira is odd okay this is a photo of him in the suit great do they have a full suit on I thought they had like legs or something because you know when they Here's another picture. Cool. He got act. He got the acting job of being and wearing the Godzilla suit. Well, I assume. What that? What for the role for this? They have to put on a suit. Oh, was that something? Hold on. Yeah, it's most recently played. There's something here. Uh, let's see. Whoa. Okay, uh... Can we get a translator on this? Well, first of all, they distorted the background image, but... And they put... I don't want to assume what text this is, but I assume... Japanese? Okay, no. We're not, we're not, we're not gonna... We're not gonna, we're not gonna see what that says then, I guess. And the act... He fell in love with it. Okay, in the context of this, does he mean... He would wear the suit most of the time to the point you never saw his actual face. It's a Toho producer. So is it like a... He loved it so much he wouldn't stop wearing it? Or did he love it like... In a romantic way? Even when he would take breaks, he would just wear the suit. The suit would sometimes heat up, but he didn't care. Yeah, I imagine that thing is hot as heck. Yes, he got married to a suit. I knew it. It was like if he was addicted to a suit and it's calling its name. Okay. 
It's gotten to the point where he brings the suit home even though we tell him not to. Are they allowed to do that? I assume not if it's like... He wouldn't really speak a lot, but he would say that his name is Goji. Basically the nickname we gave to his suit. Hmm. The last time he was seen on set, he was act he was acting in the suit until he just stopped. This is a photo that was taken. What do you mean, like me? Uh, several minutes later, he just started to walk and stop again. His breathing was muffled, yet he was breathing oddly. Okay. The director thought it was a joke, poking at him to get it back in place, but he wouldn't budge. No, I don't like this music. It's it's really getting the score settled. After two odd minutes of so oddly breathing, he would tell people to check on him and make sure he takes off the suit. Okay, is he, are they gonna do that yet, or this is a photo someone took before the person we saw right what was inside? What was inside? Man opened the suit. He was growing into the suits. So let's just slowly rip away each other. Open his pocket. Ew! That is gross. The suit was now his skin. Ew! So did he like? Did the skeleton adjust to the skin of the suit, or did it? It was like a skin fused with the suits. And somehow his body is to the point where he was filling the inside of the suits. Gross. Okay, somehow. So they don't know what happened. Or they aren't gonna tell us. This is what they expected. Okay. Suit. Him inside. This is what they found. What did they... Ugh. Ugh. Is that like a... Okay, hold on. Okay, uh, we have to backtrack on that. Just... Just so I can get a good look at that. Because... I mean, we got a look, but... It's still, like, horrible. So are these, like, his actual flesh? Like, his organs or whatever? Because there's some parts here that just kind of spurt out. Is that, like, his bones or something? Because it looks like these are his bones. He got... He's, he's like, just two legs here. He doesn't have any here. Something there. I think that's, like, his... I was expecting to hit it was in the mixtape. Yeah, that that is a mixtape. Then his skull up here that's been fitted to to do that. And I'll, unless this maybe this is his tailbone, which bro grew a whole tail. But yeah, like what are these like bits parts here? Is that like bits that are missing of him or like his organs or something? At that point, you just might have to. I don't know. If he's if he doesn't seem happy, you might have to, you know, just uh, you know, make sure he's no longer in pain. Cause I imagine being like this is not. Well, I mean, I'm sure anyone would love to be Godzilla, but not a Godzilla like this. Assumingly. Also, I know YouTube has a new color. It's like pinkish red. I kind of like that. Okay, so this is episode. One, I guess, of, I don't know how many. Twelve episodes, okay. So, uh, yeah, this is an interesting starter, I guess. I don't know, I'm very curious to see where else... Is it gonna be, like... Is it gonna cover different movies? I assume so. Alright, let's watch next one. Anger suit. I assume whoever's wearing that suit is not gonna have a good time. Okay, this is the next one. Anger suit incidents, 1955. I don't know how Actually, there might be some information. 
Uh, nope, nothing there. Well, I mean, there's obviously something there, but I can't. Mecca, I should draw a window. Should I draw a window on the dress? Oh. Mm. I wonder why you're asking that. Well, I guess I could. I could try to put it on like Google Translate or something to see what's see what that's about. But we don't have time for that right now. We're time to watch the next episode. Anger is soon it's in it because of that no more. Let's watch this in three, two, one. Play. Not one, but two. Most terrifying creatures ever loosed on man. Yeah. Each arranging a killable horror. Both on a rampage to stun your every sense. Gigantus? That's not Godzilla. Going to destroy each other. But they first need to destroy the world. Is this really how they described it back then? Gigantus is Godzilla. Gigantus. Oh, okay. The man of the gorgeous series suits. So came along for the next movie. If they stopped, told anyone about the suit man. Doho would have been sued and ridiculed for keeping such discussion creation. So he decided to keep him out of the public eye so he can beg us to go. Wow. Okay. So rather than just going, to just, I don't know, maybe taking him out, they didn't bring anyone. They could have brought someone else in. Doho wanted to find out the ultimate cause for all this. Well, yeah, I'm sure anyone would. But there had to be, there had to be safer ways. The men in the suit have been sparing by the doctors. The doctors weren't really sure about the cause, saying it might be a pill, but they weren't certain- a, a pill? What they were certain about was the outcome. Whatever he took it, or had made his skin flesh inflate, the inner suit, melting and fusing together. Somehow the outside suit is now his skin. Huh. Gross. So a pill. A pill is what he took to make himself Godzilla Man? Is that what the implication? His bones are rearranged inside the mesh to hide the suits. Rearranged. So did you make more bones? Oh, it was called Gigantus, so they called it Raids again. You could somehow feel the outer layers of his suit as of his own skin. Okay, so he has nerves on the outside then. Two, so that's straight up different. It turns out that he could see out of the eye sockets of his eyes, but the eyes are bloodshot too. That's pretty gross. His eyes are bloodshot. Yeah, I could I could see that in there. Can we can we can we cut to something else now? The name for the actor who plays Angerus is B. I wonder. I wonder why they censored their name. People on set noticed that how he was audited out by the man in the suit. No one cared to tell him what happened and what he's become. Well, I assume- why not tell him? Well, I guess he, if they did tell him, he probably wouldn't go near him. Hmm. The man in the suit was very corrupted, even after losing his vocal cords. Vocal cords? He could still make noises like one- like an uneven animal. Hmm. Well, at least he's playing along. But wait, what does he even eat? How does he use the bathroom? Everything would go great until the last scene. They had to do where they both fight. Well, was there... I'm sure there was other scenes where they fought in that movie, right? So it wouldn't just be one time. It would be multiple. Okay, so what? 
What uh, what happened in that last scene? Can you tell me? Pretty please? Oh, oh, we're getting it. We're seeing it. Oh, they actually got little people on set. Dang, he's doing all that practically. Pushing bro into a building. Oh, jeez. Oh, gosh. They're, okay, they're gonna say something like this was staged. They're, this wasn't part of it, right? The man of the girls used to was shot by the actor's head, making him bleed profusely. This was never part of the script. Ooh. Yeah, I assume you probably have to use some padding on that suit there. Get some armor on. Yeah, I agree. Yell pay for your help as the teeth planted on his head. Seconds later, the factory stopped moving. All he died, I guess. Very unfortunate. <laughs> the men in suit would protect the unconscious actor. Oh, okay, as your critic is so serious. Okay. Why would he? Why would he do that? Did he want him to bleed out? If so, RP guy. Well, actually, that probably did what happened because his name was. The actor would awaken, shake him violently, and struggles to get up on the ground. He would help him in fear, and he would try to take off the suit. It wouldn't budge. Oh gosh! Now we have two men in suits? The man in suit was held taken when the man in suit was running empty. The victim was somehow taken. When the man in suit was running empty. Okay. So what's, uh, what's the picture look like? Is it bad? This is the picture, okay? Can you show it without any lights or noises? Oh! I just felt the chill of my spine, I don't like that. Oh god, it's Freddy Fazbear. It looks like him. That's for sure. Okay, is, uh, is that it? Oh, there's more. This is what they- oh, oh gosh, it's another- Bro encased in Angerous suit. Now he's Angerous. I assume. I don't know. Maybe the suits have some property? Or if they're too hot, they fuse to your skin? Or they make whoever's inside fuse to them? Oh. Oh, another hidden message. The man is who gets a big cookie now. Oh, okay. This the I I can't read that, but the frame back here is so scary, dude. The eyes, the inner teeth back there, gross. Okay, so what did they find? What did they find in blood? Not B L O O D and B L U D. Come on, show it. Right here. You're doing it without any loud noises next time. Pretty please. I'm literally tensed up. What is it gonna be? Oh gosh. 
that's that's even worse than what happened to good, to good. Oh, ah, we gotta go back. That's even worse than what happened to Godzilla, cause at least Godzilla had some space, but this guy's just filled up the whole thing. Oh, Yasper, what did you finish doing? Take a look. Oh boy. Wow! I see. I see, okay. When am I able to do something here? Hold on. We're doing this live. Wait, no, I should just do it this way. It's better. Uh, same image as. Like this. Okay, a uh, quick intermission. Uh, we have our. And he must put. If Andy sees he, he must put it on stream. <laughs> okay, fine. Uh, here, let me find. Image. Let's see. Here it is. Bam. <laughs> First ever. Mecha and A64 arts right here. <laughs> wow, that's that's really good. I can't, I can't, <laughs> I can't hate it. I love how big you made the wings. That's cool. And I think there's a little bit of tail tail drawings down there. That's neat. It's very good. Like wow. Good job. Can't, can't, I can't, I can't deny this is really good. Like, kudos, kudos to you, kudos to you, Spirit, and you know what, you two mega for dressing me up. Smash. You would say that. You would say that. I see you. Good job. No sound sad. Good, good job. So sound sad. Huh? Good job. Sound so sad. I know it's. <laughs> Ow! I hit my foot. Um, but yeah, thank you for this. This is the first, this is the first our art stream. First time I show art on stream. Well, yeah, other than a few times, I guess. So yeah, this is a design animation. Check out the art. It's good. It's by Spirit. Go check them out. They're great. They make great art like this. And also, I'm just a little... I'm a little tired and also scared. A little tired and also scared of what's going on here. So you know, it is not the first banner. I know, but of Mecca of Andy sixty four specifically, that's what I mean. You know. So uh, yeah. Great art though. <laughs> Hand on chest too, like. But yeah, great. You're very great. All right, now we go to the next video. This is Godzilla Encounter. Oh, that's the wrong one. There we go. Let's watch this video. Let's watch the next one in the Godzilla counter is a Godzilla Adult Horror 1962. Okay, so, so is this like is this is this for the second movie, or no the third between two movies? Hold on, I don't know I don't know the timeline between movies. Cause wasn't it Godzilla or Gigantus? I guess reads again and then King Kong. It's catastrophic. The Titanic terrifying battle. Wait, I should do this. Hold on. Here. There we go. The third movie is Kong. Oh, okay, I see. Gotcha. Oh wait, yeah, and this no, it'd be better put right here. To be honest, like, because it's also they're also watching the the thing. The third movie is Kong. Okay, great. The mightiest monsters of all time. It is Kong. King Kong vs. Godzilla. Oh, he's in ice. Godzilla, blazing a trail of terror to his Japanese homeland. Tapped in water in the conning tower. That is homeland. See Godzilla this... Oh. 
King Kong. Ooh. Fire effects? Oh, it's it's more gigantic, I think. Gigantic? Can barely make out what's going on here. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Mightiest monsters of all time. King Kong vs. Godzilla in color new. Actually, yeah, I think it's kind of better up there, to be honest. With the man in the suit being only Godzilla suit at a the time, they used him for the next film. Okay. They're just gonna keep him doing gigs? He just, uh, do, you, do, do they get paid? Do they pay him still? Oh. With King Kong being an American film, the man in the suit wasn't having it. Ooh. This is where I come in. Who are you? You have a crazy smile. I'll be hiding my eyes for my name for for me and my family's safety. Well, I mean, yeah, but you have something. I don't know. I assume it, I was put into a job being able to cameraman. They told me what happened before, and they told me I'm gonna stay quiet about it, or I would be arrested. But what do you explain to the police? The truth needs to come out somehow. Hmm. The man in the suit wasn't happy making a movie with the Americans. Okay, he's a little, little biased to his homeland. So his producers forced him to look more appealing to younger audience. That is impossible. He wasn't happy with how this all played out. He had a very bad dislike towards the actor in the King Kong suit. Shoichi Iliad Rose, I think that's how you pronounce. Uh, he either thought Shoichi Hiros was a traitor for betraying the American monster or saw something in him. We knew that wasn't a big fan of Americans, he would roar at them and try to attack them. We treated him like a lion at the zoo. Wait, was it Iliad or Heroes? Because the filter makes it look like an H. We had to film one more scene. I was instructed not to stop, n to not stop filming. The script was for after destroying the big building, he would act to use atomic ray breath on him. Okay, wait. How does he use? Does he use his atomic ray breath in real life too? It did not go as planned. Please tell me how it did go. goes bad I think because they both the man in the suit would push Shoichi Iros is it heroes he rose off the cliff and I had to record it all because it it's very small but it looks like there's a thing between the it's either in two eyes or there's a struggle in the water slashing is one of their practical guys grass yeah I assume I don't know anyways to be with the man in suit is to be in underwater. Only one of them rose to the water. Kong? Because that's how the ending of the film happens. Oh. So we are going different. So, uh. Anyone gonna help out the guy in the Kong costume? Help out the boy Kong? I was six months ago, and I didn't know what he had done to Shoichi Ito's, and they got me out of the camera and ran. I tried to leave the long corridor to the studio, waiting for people for the for sure, but I heard screams from the room I had left. Uh huh. Power went out. Did he make. I used a flash of my camera to look around, frantically trying to find an exit. I heard someone say, I'm taking words. That was employee. I took a photo, wanted to watch an exit quick. It wasn't an employee. Yeah? It was the man in the suit, okay? What did, what what's he look like? Doom do me saw it and not have loud noises play. Ooh. 
That is the worst image ever I've ever seen. <laughs> Did he, did he let you leave? What did he do with the clown costume guy? Okay, wow. That was already so much. Okay, so... So, we don't even know what happened to the guy in the clown costume. Was that him? Did he just bite him or something and leave him there? Because we don't even... We don't even... Oh, my God, my shoes. Okay, we don't even get elaboration. What happened to him? What happened to the guy? Alright, next video. I'll start it by the first... Oh, this is the case. The same guy. First count of the man in suit. It may be more curious than I was time of doing this, but I need answers, okay? So I've gone to walk to my friends who was smart with this stuff. I won't name her, but I'll call her Elisa. I called her, but she was in the middle of teaching her class, and she would still call me because of her curse she busts. Oh. she never seen anything like this. Before it's actually called. Are we going voice acting? thing is, whatever this was caused wasn't from a pill. This is something else. Uh -huh. Oh, God. This is the work of radiation. Radiation? Holy. Holy shit. The man in the suit doesn't fuse with the suit instantly. His body explodes in the suit, then it reshapes itself in the suit. Ooh. How do I explain this? Imagine a cream-filled donut. Ooh. Without the cream, it's mostly a flat donut. That was the suit before, but because of the filling. The man, it basically filled up all the space. Ooh. But him and a cream-filled donut are different. The cream and donut are separate entities. There is a barrier so they don't mix. The man in the suit, however, his skin, his flesh, his bones, it's fusing with the suit. His teeth would be the suits. Whatever he took. It's mutating him. It's making him more like a creature than a human. Soon, he will have animalistic properties. Soon. Like using its teeth more effectively. And would be able to control his tail. You said his eyes could move? And that they are bloodshot? But in this photo, his eyes flashed back. Human eyes don't do that. Mm. You need to try and put him down. If not... It is probably too late for mankind. Too late for mankind? What is that? She says something about him using a beast. Well, what does that mean? Is he gonna actually go to gigantic size and be Godzilla? I was questioning whether he would be mutated. She corrected me and said there's no stopping point for the mutation. Then told me to go, to go I am as artist. He gave me a description of how I sadly forgot now. Oh, go to am artist. So a artist. Told him to make the art, and they compiled. My Japanese would be a bit rusty because I thought I asked for one drawing, but I got three. Okay, so we got three different arts. Here are the drawings. Are these what he's gonna turn into? Or are these gonna? Good arts, props to the artist, but I should see this thing walking around. Ew. What does not have human eyes anymore? That looks kind of like legendary. Well, I guess this guy also does too. His hand is weird out also. So that's a thing. Oh, another video. I stuck around the Toho building after the encounter with the man in the suits. I found a tape labeled. I realized it was some years after the Angerous incidents. Okay. Let me just show it. Okay. Hmm. 
私たちは自分たちが置かれている状況を十分に認識しています。私たちは彼らが聞くために何が必要かをテストするために参戦を尽くします。両方に対していくつかの音声通を試してみます。まずはスーツを着た男性から始めましょう。Let's start with the fire and 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 the fire
but fine, I'll share this one too. Uh, here. Where is it? I just saved it, but now it's gone. Here we go. Here's another. <laughs> Well, yeah, they they really. They're... Man, when you inspired with something inspired, you really get onto it. <laughs> Why is he so pretty? <laughs> I don't blame you. Uh, I mean, yeah, that's good too. Also, great artwork. Let's put it up there. Can you repeat that? Uh, you know, when you wanna when you wanna make art, you really get onto it quickly sometimes, cause. You were able to do this while I was reacting to scary stuff. That's what I, that's what I mean, you know. Here, I think that's good. Why does it just fix this one? What? Your your how how would I how do I put this? Your fast drawer, I guess. You doodle these. Well, not doodle. These aren't doodles. You draw them quickly. Is what I'm saying. Like you draw them quicker than I think I thought you would. I think is what I'm trying to say. So, but don't don't get it twisted. You, these are really good. Like honestly, I, lo I love the art that you make. Spooky stuffed with fan art. Yeah. Well, welcome to Halloween. Do you want more art? <laughs> uh, no, no, no. You don't have you don't have to make more art. You don't have to make more art, Link Spirit, unless you want. You know, if you want to make more for me, if you want to make more arts. That's Okay, okay. Um Okay. I guess. If that's so more art then, okay. Uh I guess we're gonna see more art later. Okay, yeah, so that was that was that video. Now we have a new video. Godzilla and mail message. Mail to message. Nineteen sixty four. Nineteen sixty four. Nineteen sixty eight two. Let's go. I don't think someone. What what was that? Someone in. To, hold on. I don't think someone in Toho Studio made this. Okay. You don't understand. You killed my family. You Americans cheered when we lost. We lost our homes. We lost our families. You nuked us all. The nuke took my wife. Decided to return peace by getting rid of the people who wronged us. Uh, is that like was that a message from the man? Oh. So, like, a message from the man before he was fully committed by the suit, I guess? Ugh. Ugh, that was horrifying. Growing more, te more teeth out of his mouth? I was recently got two sets of mail. But they were shabby. F they were shabby, but they came from Toho. Okay. They didn't look professional. They looked sloppy. Really. What did they... 
One was how nobody at the home mailed me the mere package. She then the mailing address once from there. Okay, so it was the man in suit, I assume. Second was that I was fired. They must have thought I was telling people this. They were correct. Well, yeah. So what, are they going to send the man in a suit after him? Thankfully, I had befriended someone to be a spy and get more photos and tapes of what was happening. Alright. Because, yeah, they, they need to call somebody to come pick up the man in a suit. He came here earlier with a tape called Dorsal Extraction. It's referring to the dorsal plates bro has on guy. Cool. We will try and get him out of the suit. Okay. I don't see how you could unless it just you're unsure of how this is going to work. Well, uh, given by how many videos are afterwards, I assume it won't work. Oh. There's the, there's the man. Are they gonna try to, are they trying to take him out to dorsal first or something? Like try to take out all the dorsal plates on his back? And then just yoink him out? Maybe? He was very cooperative. Okay, but Loki, that's a little. Wouldn't shouldn't that be more worrying than if he wasn't? We thought it would hurt him, but it didn't. Oh. Then that's good. The results are fantastic. Well, that's. Out of why would you word it like that? So does it mean yes? Like there is a way to cut him out or not? Oh, is that is that them taking out the plates or something? Oh, I'm surprised that isn't the end. But this isn't the end because of the spy told me that after two minutes I was being filmed, the man in the suit would attack a camera with the man. He told me the flash from the camera hurt his eyes. Ah. Oh. So they got the doors and plates off him, it seems. Wait, so the man told him that? The man in the suit told him the flash hurt his eyes. The person took photos while they ran. These are the photos, okay. Oh. His foot. Back away from his feet. Oh, it's his shoulder maybe? his leg. It's a hand. Uh, that's the face. Uh. Wow, that was... What? Anger suit. Oh, it's... We're getting a anger suit and anger suit. Uh... Okay, so this is different. After digging for it, they okay. This is another video, I guess. After digging for it, they finally found it. Yeah. They finally kept the tape I wanted. I want to know what happened to the man in the anger suit. Oh yeah, we didn't. 
We don't even know what happened to him. Oh. He sometimes they have pure darkness as it's bright all of a sudden. We have tried our best to comply with the other person mutating in the suits. But yeah, what happened to that guy? Was it also radiation? What is presence hurts I find finances. Persistence? People want to see him, but he doesn't want to be seen. Oof. Well, at least he's more... Less... Animal-like, maybe? I was confused at first. That was all? Yeah, was that... Hmm. Maybe. Then he started to explain. Yeah? He explained that the next movie was supposed to be the man in the angry suit versus the man in the suit. Huh. I imagine why that did not go well. They try to have their best funnies to comply with anger, except they train to do dogs and do tricks. That's a little dehumanizing. He snapped a photo of them trying to comply with the angerists. Well, he doesn't look full of the eyes, but other than that, he looks just fine. They said they were going to force him using tasers and stuff. Jesus. That's even worse. But he warned me that there was a movie in the works. Something about Gorgira battling a... A... Giant moth. Bothra! Oh yeah, how is that one gonna work? Does, does, does Mothra use a suit? Is a Mothra a suit? Does someone... Someone in there? Oh. Next video. Oh, uh, Randus paper. No closed captions. I have tried to get off of this situation, but I just leave Japan. But if I try to, I'd probably be arrested. Hmm. I went too far into this rabbit hole. Too far to the point I can't get out. Well, yeah, I imagine. It just keeps getting worse. Are we ever going to get elaboration on how the man man came to be destroyed by the man in the suit? Somewhere in the making of the new movie, man in the suit somehow escaped. That's worse. How do I know this? How do you know this? Did you help free him? Maybe. So his identity is just completely out in the public now. Pretty much it. If a Godzilla-like creature is out, or just a guy in a Godzilla suit is out. Cosplayer. Monstrous monster movie saying... Or, I read that so wrong. Monstrous... Monstrous movie monster saying. Sightings and witnesses have called this creature that resembles a lanky and tall Godzilla. Lanky? Ugh. Late night, a couple starts trouble home, but the husband took some photos. The husband was a producer and thought to take a picture with Rod would be special for his next photo piece. Oh, great, more photos. We love to see it. This was the photo. Oh, why did the photo capture this? Let's see this. It's gonna be, it's gonna be horrifying. Uh, I was right. Bro is huge too. That's a giant. That's huge. And bro is in a big suit. Unless he made the suit somehow grow. Give me more photos. A rally internet. The boy would see a silhouette of this mysterious beast. Take it to Godzilla. He's stored outside. Take a picture. Take a photo. Take a photo. Oh no, boy! Don't get away from that Godzilla suit. He's not gonna take a picture with you. Stay away from him. He's a monster. He'll eat you. 
These were the photos he was able to take for what he got eaten. Yeah, bro is bro is really tall. Both toes, so more than one. Oh, so one of him walking, one of him sideways, and one of him looking straight at them. Okay. That's next to a car too, bro. It's tall. We tried to have an interview with the kid, asking him the scene and draw a picture of the preacher. Police brought in pursuit. Show us the picture. I've seen a film with my dad. I know what it will look like, said the kid. Well, are you gonna get the kid's name? The thing I saw inside the street wasn't Godzilla. Yeah, I assume. Even kids would know there's a difference between Godzilla and whatever horrible monstrosity this guy is. Very uncanny. Yeah, uncanny? Say that again. I don't think it was a creature. It might have been some man in a suit. Oh, if only you knew. It's okay, what's the news? So I got wind of this test. It's my English question. Wow. Yep, cover up. You're quickly becoming the new Freddy Fazbear entertainment. Somehow they were able to stop more any more copies of the story from printing again, huh? Well, good. Wait, on the news, do they mean like was radio television a thing back then? Well I mean radio obviously, but television like straight up. I have too many questions. What was he doing outside? How did he even escape? Were Toho able to capture him? Were they able to? Who knows? Find out next time. A man in the suit. Mm hmm. Yes, they have TV. Oh, okay. Oh, again with the moth. Oh, Ma Mas Masura students, and here we go. So we're getting we're getting to see what happened. It's really crazy how they can take old footage of Godzilla movies and make him heavily altered with filters and such and make him look pretty disturbing. Mothra. How crazy would it be if the man in the suit was in the monsterverse? That should be the next movie. Despite Edward Friend had told me what happened during the time when the man in the suit had escaped, okay? Let's get some elaborating. He told me that something went wrong. Well, what else is new with this guy? He said, what had happened because he knew the man in the suit was there. 
Mm hmm. He lathered that some paste and made him look different and a bit shiny. Huh. Is paste good for him? He had to wear glossy type of thing, get highest bloodshot eyes. Well, if it helps. He was forced forced to withstand high wind. Did he not like the high wind? It was a little annoying to him. He was dragged around. Well, unless he completely didn't want to be put under all this. He was treated like a circus stamp. Oh, okay, here we go. It's back to circles back to cruelty and now we have to root for him even though he's a horrible monstrosity but at the same time it was still oh that put him in there their production is in another side of the monster and will be replaced by a puppet well yeah that makes a lot more sense you end up with someone in the mocker suit the man in the suit saw Mothra as a living being. He thought someone was inside the puppet because of how life's like that. Huh, so he didn't believe. So he doesn't know what puppets are? So he's like smart, but not that smart. Well, at least. Not that smart anymore. It seems. Toho thought that was a very smart tactic until they realized I had a problem. Well, what bigger problem would result if not having anyone in the suit? Please elaborate. Someone needed to be in one of the lava suits. Oh, there it is. They couldn't have puppets with the larvas. One female actor thought it'd be a good idea because of how much security they had. She agreed to be one of the shots being inside of the lava suits. Oh boy, this is this is where things get bad. It was originally her first day in the job, and they invited her parents to see her act. Her parents didn't care what the character she was in the movie. They were happy to see her in the production. Oh boy, that doesn't sound good at all. Uh -uh -uh. Sadly, the amount of security wasn't going to help the trap she put herself in. Is that so? I mean, they should have, like, security around everybody. As long as they're not on the camera, they should be flooded with securities. In one of the scenes they were filming, the man in the suit snapped. Even more than he already has? After removing the monster putting into it, he realized the mouth was a puppet. He went ballistic. How would he know? He didn't see any blood? And charged after the woman in the larva suit. Did he know there was a woman in there? Oh, here we go. Oh, boy. Uh, bless her soul. Just gonna chomp into her. The man in his suit charges forward against the other suit. Uh-oh. Oh, no. The larva suit had plenty of headroom for it to look down, but I wouldn't stop me from charging deeper. Don't do it. While her head gets bitten, their parents see everything. Jeez. Maybe like word backwards or something, so don't really bite your feet or something like that? Oh, do her parents like interfere or something? Oh. They tried to intervene. Okay, what happens now? I uh, like how slow they're moving. Okay, what happened? They were both molted to death. Ooh. That's even worse. But what happened to the what happened to the after mulling them, Levy tried to protect the larva suit. Pressure moved right this time. Okay. So what happens? Do they do they actually get her out in time? What's what's going on?
Fifth tasers, they send him away with the lever suit, and somehow through the rage, he barges through security and escapes. So that's how he got out. So tasers is his weakness. We know that for sure. There was a team that they called this could be dispatched to catch the man in the suit. Four men were tasked to stay out of the, the larva still, wanting to get her out of the suit. New order to drop to okay, we'll check that out right now. No check that out right now. It's weird. The spy was to get the spy was in the team to get the man in the suit. It took an hour to find the man in the suit. What's better than not finding him? They saw him looking around in the forest as he was wandering around and looking at nature. Oh, bro just wanted to bro just wanted a peaceful walk through nature. Nothing wrong about that. I'd assume. As if he was calm. That's kinda wholesome. The calm just broke as he saw people trying to capture it. Uh, they didn't. They didn't have like Jurassic Park. I know. I knew. I knew a new artist job. I'll show it right now after this part ends. The man in the suit was surrounded. I'll share it right now. One second. It will start to shake violently. Oh. What does that mean for him? He twitched and a sudden sound as he was vibrating. Uh, bros tweaking? Oh! Ugh! It vomited a red flame liquid, presumably his own blood. Oh, he locked. That is his atomic breath. Gross. Boiling liquid. That's straight out of Shin Godzilla. But uh, I don't like. I don't need that sound. Gross. So what did he spew this on all over the people trying to grab him, or what? What happened? It was probably a last resort the creature had, but somehow they took hold of the beast and took it back. Well, that's good. Spy took a picture of what was left. What, what was left of what? Oh, jeez. Your boiling is an understatement of what that is. For sure. Now look quickly, put the man in his suit in a secure place. Okay. They feared the worst coming back. Okay. Is it with uh, the larva? The girl in the larva suit? This is what they expect. Okay. Show us what expected and then what actually happened. Oh. Well, this is this is what they expected. What what's what would the outcome be? This is what they found. Yeah. Was it her? She just stuck to the ceiling. Or made an egg out of herself? Wow. Okay.
That was gross, but now we have art to share. To soothe the, the calmness of... <laughs> That's also great. Wow. Hold on. You all must see what I see. More art from the spirit. Bam. Check it out. Really great. I like this. What am I holding? Is it just like a little book? Book thing? Book pad? No book kind of deal? Whatever the case, it's, it's very cute. Very nice. Added to the added to the art stuff up there. Oh, let me let me fix it. Oh yeah, I can do this. Just no, we can't. Wait, wait. There we go. That way it's a little less compact. Well, I mean less spaced out. So I'm trying to say. There. This is good. Very good. Go subscribe to Spirito Link. They make they're a great artist. Now let's get back to the scary. Right now. I've got several updates what happened after the Mussar incident. Seven updates. Wait, how many is left? Stop making it a hunt. <laughs> okay, one more. Seven important things happened during that, okay? Can we get an elaboration? The spy had passed by a room where the Toho executive and government figures. A government figure? That's concerning. You don't want anyone from the government there. They were talking about the current state of the matter. And what is that? What is the current state? Talking about the cocoon, the current state was a good thing, the news, etc. Yeah, the cocoon is pretty worrying. I'm not gonna lie. The most important thing I got was that I was finally knew what was helping them along with hiatus. Okay, someone from the government? Sadly, it was the cocoon. The cocoon or chrysalis was forming in one of the warehouses that stored the props for filmmaking. Okay. That's also just as worrying. They got people to try and take it off, but when touched cocoon sprayed orange gets plenty of them. Presumably something radioactive or poisonous. <laughs> then they evacuate the horror house and then removing it so they kept saying anything. Dining record is? I'm very agitated about this whole situation. They're doing the stupid little mistakes that ruin other people's lives. Well, that's an understatement. Apparently, scientists and specialists arrive at the scene where the man is super leased and oh. Everything the same for the puddle before, but they were meant for this. What were they meant for? Bro made a geyser. It had, gotten to, it, had, it had gotten so bad that they needed people in hazmat suits so they can come closer to the puddle. As they looked through the puddle, they realized they needed to shut down the area. Why, was it radioactive? I assume it would be. They were too afraid to s touch the substance, so they closed down the area. Well, that's to be... Thank for at least someone in the ice since photo said they could have seen an eyeball in the foreign puddle. I'm sure they believe the claims a good thing over the whole sword. Bro reproduced. Mm. 
they were taking their chances looking closer so they could find the eye in the puddle. So, the bro, like, eject Manila from his mouth or something? Weren't successful finding the eye in the puddle. The area around him was shut down. Okay, so it wasn't. It's just a theory, I guess. Ding, ding, ding. It was just something that they're gonna put in there and saying, oh, don't worry about it. It's probably nothing. But we don't know for sure. Fifthly, I found it. Yeah, they're going to make another movie despite what's going on. Okay. Can they up the security? Up the tasers? Use no more actors. Just have guy and puppets. Six, I've gotten mail from one of my daughters. How many daughters do you have, bro? Hopefully they don't work at Toho. Uh, fictional Toho, to be clear. This universe. Oh. It's a, it's a letter. Call it right some. What are you ready? Oh. Me, mommy, you, camera. Oh, mom does not look happy. I assume they got through some stuff. We miss you, daddy. You're not. I have been worried that you and I are not supposed to be in the movie. What's going on? Okay, so that's from the mom. I miss them. Huh? I'm stuck here. I'm only here to show what happened. Star screen. Last thing I got updated was getting a concert for what the new monster would look like. Yeah, what's the monster? This time I'm going to try to intervene, okay? I can't let this happen, not for a third time. Well, I mean, yeah, I agree, but also, like, I don't know. Make, make sure I find a way to do it and not get captured by the monster man. Okay, who's the, who's the... Oh! King Ghidorah! Are they gonna horribly mutate this? Are they gonna have three actors in each of the heads? Here we go. Ghidorah suit incidents. Here we go. Boom! Oh, is this... Giant monsters on left. Nothing the screen has ever shown before can suppress the thrills of Ghidorah. The three headed monster. Beedy 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 beedy. Do it, make the, make the beedy beedy. Oh, I guess. Might be copyrighted. So how decided to be more careful gotcha the film and the next film. I imagine so. The plan was to make a semi puppet semi suit oh it's possibly confuse the man suit, okay. Well confusion probably wouldn't lead to anything good, I assume. So how it with new materials, materials that we listen to heavy damage, okay? That is good. These interiors are brrr, brrr, and brrr. I mean, you could, you could just tell us so we know what materials he can't do bad with. The lower body would have this toughened material. Head and neck cover made from puppeteering, meaning they won't be made of this material. Okay, so what if he just rips the heads off? Uh, 
Most kaiju that were in the film were puppets, learning the mistakes from last time. The live girl was Mako the Nile puppet. Yeah, I imagine so. This time I will intervene. Bro, is it bringing a gun? Respectfully, I don't think that's gonna stop it. And also, dude, if they say they have it, they probably have it. No one sends this kid to go to work with a shotgun. This needs to be towed down once and for all. Okay? I respect your I expect your bravery, bro, but I don't know if this is gonna this is gonna do it. Because at least they're not at least they're not not being unable to not do it. What am I trying to say? At least they're taking precautions. That's what I'm trying to it's pure changes, I'm not sure how. It might be Dohill's turn. Well, I guess that's a good way of explaining. All monsters attack was made around the end of the show era. Okay. Oh, I gotcha. So, if this isn't stopped, so that's gonna be next. So, this team was carrying on by this time. Well, I mean, sure. You gotta do what you can for the bank, right? Whoever this conference was put to the test, okay? Let's see, was it were they doing good and you're interfering messed it up? That's what I'm 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 thinking. They only had one last thing to film. Man Sue was behaving crappily because of heavy security, okay? One last thing, okay, so they do this and then boom, bank. The man of Sue can probably take a bite of the actor because of the tough and mystery. Okay, good. Oh, is it gonna do the blood thing again? However, they have forgotten about one thing. Yeah? According to the builds, his neck and his head and neck were the most vulnerable parts. Mm. How can they forget that? Head and neck was he could have attacked. Okay, arms and hands, so it's not the head, at least. But it is still, uh... There was a contraption that makes it so a suit actor would pull a lever to open the mouth of Ghidorah. Well, that does make sense. You know? And even looking at here, it does seem pretty practical. So that's cool. And that's probably how it worked out well. And one of the last shots of Man of Sue would just stay there. Not moving. Okay, well... End the film. Cut, cut to black. Done. You would start to shake valley. Oh, no. We know what that means. I assume. The man is seen there to do something, but I to see if the got too close. Oh. The man is seen with the head of the door. Okay, well, just the head. It's not the neck, at least. And that's a good ending. You just end it right there. Wow, that's it's deep in there. Messy with oh oh, but puke the same running blood and stuff as in the suit suit's head. Hopefully, there's no hole in the head down to the actor. Maybe. Ah. Uh. Never mind. There has to be something that's meant to be interesting in the support of the neck. That's that's very worrying. Is this bro gonna get boiled alive inside? Or we don't even we don't even know what the effects of the boiling blood are. That's when it's starting to suit However, some of the workers were confused. Well yeah, you're coming in with the shotgun while well, this is all going on. Well I guess now it's probably the best time to interfere. They were confused about me bringing a guitar case, the shotgun I brought being inside of it. Oh, well, that's easy to explain. Uh, I score, I scored the movie. This is my guitar. I do the thing at the end. They stopped me and asked me a question. Where have you been? What? Bro, was fired. I asked, wasn't I fired? Are they gonna say no? Sorry, I'm like interested now. 
You never were. They're playing what? What? What does that mean? Does whoever send it be faked? Was there a fake firing message? Oh, jeez. As I barged through and argued their comments, I realized that they had a power box in the room. The sad that they had had a power box in the room. Okay. We must have noticed becoming a puking in his blood. Head of the Ghidorah suit, he faced the power box. He noticed him. Oh. It happened so fast. Oh boy. There's the. There's, why do you keep the Paris the power box so close to the monster man? Both times. What about the security? Where's where are they? Oh gosh. This is this is straight up just found footage. Oh wet floor sign, that's good. Oh my god, we're gonna see something horrible, aren't we? It's gonna be oh is that is that is that is that you're walking right towards him, dude! Don't do it! Or is that- was that him back there? Oh, that's him, never mind. Oh. Pick up your camera, dog! Oh no, we're gonna see it, aren't we? We're gonna see it. Oh! Oh. Ugh. Oh! Did he shoot his head off? Or sorry, uh, blasted with the uh, uh, unrelated bullets of an unrelated gun. So he won? Oh. Does it seem successful? Are those his eyes? I can't. I can't even tell if you look at them. No, oh, never mind. It's, he's just laying there. Whoa! What is that? Was that the Ghidorah head? Okay, this little. A little more time. Ugh. Ew. Oh. What is that moving? Is that the blood? Is that what's inside? Oh. Even process what's going on. Oh, what's this? Is that is that it? Like, does did it, did the Ghidorah rise from near death and now another Ghidorah in a suit? And also, what happened to Bro here? Or I guess what happened to this guy? Was he just crawling along and then... But did the guy get a shot in? We don't even know. If that's the case, it didn't work because Bro seems to have spawned a new head right here. Let's look. No head. And then head. No head. Head. Yeah, but then there was whatever was going on here. Bro, like, regenerating, I guess? Coming back to life, maybe? And what is whatever that substance was. And then just emitting into a new form, a new being that is Ghidorah in the suits. Oh man, Ghidorah. Whatever's going on here. I, I can't even. Because we, and, and that's it, isn't it? And there's nothing after. Absolute cinema. New artist job. Oh boy. Right, as, right on cue. Right on cue. Let's see it. 
Awesome. I love this. <laughs> okay, look. Okay, so yeah, I'm here. This is me. I'm Ande. And whoever is also here with me, uh, his name is Vande, right? He's me. Except he's not me. He just looks like me. And he wears a B on his thing. So that's... This is him. It's Vande. <laughs> And a, oh no, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> great, very great. Thank you, Spirit, for coming by and drawing all these. This is really good. You're awesome. But yeah, this is also great. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> I love it. I love it so much. You're awesome. Very great. Very funny. Okay. So yeah, like this is all for uh right now, I guess, for Man in the Suit. The last oh the last video was last video was June of twenty twenty four. Well, this video the one with the, you know, Ghidorah suit incident. So uh yeah, that's pretty much pretty much it, I think. Um, for the for the for the spooky scary thing, which don't get me wrong, I <laughs> I had my volume down the whole time. I, I didn't want to hear all the scariness. But like, bro, it was getting to me. But I still wanted to continue because it was so interesting, you know? And of course, go on with all this art, of course. Shout out to Spirit for drawing all this. They're the goat. They're great. Uh, link to their channel will be in the description below. Both Twitch and uh, YouTube. And of course, also link to the original stuff with the uh, uh, Ghidorah suit incidents, or just the whole suit stuff with the man in the suits. The whole man in the suit series will be in the description below. Watch them first, and then watch me come back to watch their react. To come back and watch my reaction to them, you know? Because that's what we do. We support the project, and then we come back to watch my supporting of the project. That's probably not the right way of putting it, but I think that's how I word it either way. Anyways, thank you all for tuning in, both on stream and watching uh, whenever I upload this to YouTube, probably probably after a few edits. But it's fine, it's chill. So, uh, yeah, thank you all for watching. This has been uh, my reaction to the Men in Suit stuff. It was definitely more interesting than I thought it would be. Well, not not saying it wouldn't be interesting, but also more like like I wanted to know what would happen instead of, you know, being scared the whole time, which I usually am, to be honest. But yeah, I'm gonna try to. This video is not scary because art. That is true. You know what? That is true. The art, your arts, which thank you, Spirit. You know what? Thank you for tuning in and making all this art during the stream. And it calmed me. It calmed me a little bit because every time I would get scared, I would look, I would look at one of them and then be a little bit calmer. You know? It would help. It would help. It would help soothe us. You know? It helps soothe me. So, uh, yeah, thank you all for watching. This has been, this has been my reaction to Man of Suit watching this live with my friends. They're, they're in the chat right now, but, you know, see you later. <laughs> wow, you're good. You're, 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 you know what? I'll, I'll embrace it. You know what? Fine. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys. See you. <laughs> oh, yeah, I do. Thank you. Thank you. I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.